Greetings so much you copper grease out there, Mike from Comic Frontline here and welcome to my comic review and in this review I'll be reviewing digitally from all new all different Marvel the continuation of Power Man and Iron Fist issue number 7 and this is still the Civil War 2 tie-in and from what you see from the cover and from what happened in the last issue Iron Fist got arrested and is now in jail because of what happened with the police officers and the whole cat thing of what's relating to Civil War II. So now we're going to unfold what will happen now. So it starts off with Iron Fist, known as also Danny Rand, talking to Misty Knight, who is Danny's ex-girlfriend. And here's what she looks like, with great artwork, I should say. And she's just talking like saying, you know, you're facing uh, charges for assaulting a police officer and all the stuff that's going on and saying, you know, didn't you think of, uh, you know, calling your friend uh, Luke about this and, uh, you know, why that you called me and not your friend? So, uh, you know, Luke Cage is just really upset about this, of uh, just trying to uh, maybe just find a way uh, to get him out of there and everything. And also, Jessica Jones calls him and saying that there's someone that's uh, stalking them, and she's going to find out information about uh, who it is, um, and all this other stuff. So, Luke Cage was actually telling her what's going on now, and he really wants to find out how to save uh, his friend. But he said, but do be careful, though, because they have a baby as well. So we get a little bit of a... Um, story of what it is like for him in uh, the prison and you know come to think of it like what someone said you know uh, you have like these superpowers and you could like bust out of here right and I like when he says this I could but that will just make a bad situation worse I like how when someone has superpowers and doesn't use it for you know that reason you know just to take the easy way out but um, you know he just doesn't want to do that and because that's, you know, the police just brought him in uh, to do justice, and good guys don't do that. So he talks with Gadget and Martha Cardona that talk about a uh, little tablet-like thing of what they're looking at and rebooting the software. And in Latin, it says Omnibus, which means recognition. And it's a software that can, you know, recognize your face and everything. And, um... They like lots of stuff that uh, happened also, including uh, I have this story about back in Cumberland, and I don't want to give too much away. I want you guys to definitely read the book. And I like how Jessica Jones is like trying to calm him down, like saying, I'm thinking clearly, I'm a superhero, and I think clearly. So I like how Jessica Jones tries to calm him down. Also, we get uh, Raymond Piranha Jones, who talks with. Dontro Cockroach Hamilton, who was behind the whole thing of, you know, from what we saw from the last issue, like saying, you know, uh, you snitched on us and all this other stuff, but he's trying to say that he's got more information than before, and it just goes back and forth where Iron Fist gets into a fight with someone in the jail prison, and he knocks them out, and he wouldn't see that coming, and now at the end... We see Ulysses talking to Captain Marvel, saying that Luke Cage, Power Man, leading a jailbreak at Rikers Prison. So then she says, all right, crew, you heard Ulysses, let's go stop a jailbreak. And that right there is to be continued. Oh, boy. This whole Civil War II is really uh, getting out of hand now. Now with Captain Marvel, who's trying to prevent that from happening. I mean, he's just trying to save his best friend, but it's like really chaotic. But um, a really interesting book. Rating I give for this interesting in a way between a uh, you know what? I'll give it a 4 out of 5 star rating. It was, uh, no, you know what? Between a 4 to 4.5 out of 5 I'll give it. It was a great book really interesting to find out um, the whole thing of what, you know, how Iron Fist feels about being in prison, as well as his friend Luke Cage, Power Man, trying to find his way to save uh, his best friend from jail. 
So what's going to happen next, I don't know, but it looks like it's going to be a lot chaotic than last issue. But, uh, you know, great all work and great story, like I said, and uh, definitely go pick up this book if you've been reading this all this time. So with that, everybody, that's my comic review of Power Man and Iron Fist, issue number 7. Of, of course, of War 2 tie-in. Before I go, don't forget to check out ComicFlying.com, ZoneFullPockets.com, and our YouTube game channel, Frontline Gaming Zone. And no more source for comic and game related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Click that subscribe button, so that way you'll know what videos we upload daily. And also, leave your comments uh, in the comments section about this book, likes, dislikes, or anything else you have to say about the book. Let me know, and I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can. So to all your comic careers out there, I'm Mike from Comic Frontline, and I'm saying take care and keep watching. Hey, everybody.